They'll be calling you a radical. Kevin Blanche, here for the San Onofre Spent Fuel Catastrophe NRC Grandstand. We are God hearing. This is where it'll be right here. Don't you think, don't you love it where they set it up? Oh, the NRC are elitist? I thought they were a government appointed commission. Oh, they really think there's something else. I'll tell you how arrogant. Now, first off, before I go on this rant about the NRC, their arrogance, and I don't know, who do they think they are? We had, we got some major breaking news, twofold. One, there was a uranium in Illinois at the Honeywell plant. Thank you to the union workers who got this to me. Thank you for you guys for actually getting into the domain in FIBA. The Honeywell plant in Illinois takes raw uranium. They transfer their raw uranium into a process that turns it into nuclear fuel for reactors. It goes to Paducah, which Paducah is a catastrophe. I don't think it really goes to Paducah anymore. I think it goes right to White 12, Megan Rice, Oak Ridge, Tennessee. But make to make more nuclear bombs, which they're illegally not supposed to be making. But it's a big deal. They had an accident. They released it into the atmosphere. The half-life of this stuff is hundreds and hundreds of thousands of years. Very dangerous, the mapping. And I want people to know in Illinois, the people that work in the area, what in there, the, the playbook for anything nuclear, anything nuclear, which has been developed by the NRC. The NRC is supposed to protect. This is the culture that they've developed. This is the culture they've developed is anytime there's an accident, they have a playbook. Lie, 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 lie. Keep the public in the dark. Keep the public in the dark. You know, that's what they do. Second, the USS Reagan, I'm gonna go over there this morning to the ship harbor. There's still no marine layer in San Diego all summer long, no marine layer whatsoever. Drought from hell, oh, very scary drought, big time. I mean, it was in the 80s again yesterday, late October, but the USS Reagan, this is a big, big deal. Janet is still not ruled. We're going to go over there. USS Reagan, they have moved it. This is a big, big story. Big story. Now remember, you know, we've been all over this. I protested at the Chargers game that the San Diego Chargers practiced on the USS Reagan after come back to Fukushima, Japan. Little League football camp on it, a sleepover camp. USS Reagan is being moved. It's going to be, I believe, swapped out with the George Washington is going to port here. And the Reagan's going to go to port in Japan. Wow. If that isn't an indictment, let's get real. Let's get real. My father, who was marching into the trenches, right here, Pendleton. Pendleton Marine, right here. Right up the road, right here. Oh, San Onofre's right there. Human guinea pig like a lab rat. Died of leukemia, 40,000 of them. And now we know genetically, now their kids are all getting leukemia. Oh yeah, I'm one of them. I just talked to some baby wolves in here. I said, when are you guys gonna chew your way out of the cage? This is your issue here in San Diego. Now, what I'm gonna be on these guys about, this whole dry cast is bullshit. You know it's bullshit. They think they can make law. They can't make law. Only Congress can make law. And they say, well, Congress is broken, they won't do it. That's the way he wants it. That's the way he gets it. Some man you just can't reach. And I got news for you. Once you get, if that's the way the American populace wants Congress, that's the way it is. That's just the way it is. That's the way Congress, that's the way this Constitution works. And you can take your Patriot Act, stick it in your ass, the Unpatriot Act. These guys are saying that they're going to dry cast on Oh, no. Oh, no. Political will is going to change in this country. They have no congressional power. They told Barbara Boxer's office to pound sand, who has all the power of the Constitution. She's a, I hope she's here. Uh, she has all the power of the Constitution. You know, she's a voter official that's the committee chair, which has all the powers, all the power. Congress wields incredible power. Incredible. Yeah, just because they don't do nothing, and they're in gridlock because they are representing American American populace is ignorant and gone. Yeah, they're overworked. I, I want to uh, say one other thing to my friend Kramer on Wall Street. Thank you this morning, Kramer. Thank you. He went on a rant this morning about China. Why is nobody talking? Why is people not the abuses that go over there, the apple slave, the whole thing? <laughs> well, come on, Kramer. You know there's a simple freaking answer. It's called the tariff right there at the port, Hamilton. But big deal, they've moved the Reagan. They human guinea pig those kids, and you know, they're dying. And you know, when I, Libby and I were there, and 
you know, our small group, it's pretty outrageous that the American populace refuses to support those kids. It's pretty outrageous. I support them. Semper Fi. Like I've supported the atomic veterans since I was a boy. You know, now their kids are getting leukemia. I'm one of them. But in Illinois, do not trust or believe any word that Hunt Honeywell says. They're liars. Every word that comes out of these people. And remember, the NRC is supposed to protect us. They're, supposed to, they're not us. They're hijacked like every other. They're not even a government agency. They're appointed a commission. Now, Allison resigned. Allison was way too good for that place. I'm glad she resigned. She's too good of a person to be thrown to those evil rats. And I got news for you, NRC. They'll get an earful from me in here today. Hope you can show up. We're at the Omni Resort in Carlsbad, San Diego. This, this will be a historic event because as San Onofre goes, the rest of this nuclear madness is going to go. The playbook is going to be set here. And that's why it's so important that I'm here to call these criminals out for who they are and have it recorded in history that the NRC overstepped beyond overstepped their bounds, committed treason. These are crimes. Dry cast on site. <laughs> what, because Harry Reid said he didn't want to yuck it? Who died made Harry Reid God? You know? He doesn't have that power either. Oh, I guess he does. Well, that'll change on the 4th, it looks like. Be in D.C. on the 5th for the Million Mass Man March, which is going to be a powerful major event. Hopefully some of you Wall Street geeks can show up and jump ship, you know? So, here today, October 27th. Don't you think that's an irony, the day they did it? October 27th, 1962. Wow. Wow. The nuclear cartel almost took down the world that day. Well, they're trying to here because if San Onofre, it falls off that cliff. I don't care, you dry cast, whatever. That stuff needs to go. Congress passed it. Congress passed it. You can disagree with it all you want. It, but Yucca Mountain's built, and that's where it belongs. And Congress approved that. And you keep back on Congress. Now, you want to change that? Then go through Congress. You want to turn the entire country into American toxic? 262 nuclear waste dumps all over. You want to do that? Put a vote to Congress. Congress approves it, go for it. That's the way he wants it, that's the way he got it, but they ain't gonna approve it. No, so these guys just play God. Back door the Constitution, back door everything our fathers fought for. Hope to see you here. Stan Tunis.